Writer E. Jean Carroll and Donald Trump are face to face inside a courtroom. So Carroll is taking the stand today in her defamation trial against the former president. Antoine Lewis is live with the very latest. Antoine, the saga continues. It does, Bianca. Good afternoon, Chris, as well. She told the court that 26 times over three days, the president called her a liar back in 2019. Let's show you video. E. Jean Carroll arriving to the federal courthouse this morning, and she's taking the stand. She said that her career as an advice columnist, as well as an author, suffered tremendously after repeated attacks by the former president, who is in the courtroom. Now, she took the stand. This is the civil trial where she is seeking damages against Trump for defamatory comments that he made while he was in office. He denied knowing her, assaulting her, and said that she made it all up to promote a book. Uh, last May, a jury found Trump guilty of sexually assaulting Carol in a department store dressing room and awarded her a $5 million judgment. That was the criminal trial. Now, this trial, again, is civil. It's about monetary and possibly punitive compensation, again, for the defamation that she has accused the president by calling her a liar in public and the harm that it imposed to her career. The AP is reporting that she is seeking $10 million in monetary damage and millions in punitive. As you come back to us again, the president is in the courtroom. This trial is expected to last about three to four days. We're not sure if the president will be sticking around because yesterday he was in place in the morning before the lunch break, and then he went on the campaign trail. So that might be a similar circumstance today, but we'll, of course, stay on top of it. I uh, just told you that part. Anyway, that's the very latest from where we are. Back inside to you. All right, Antoine, stay warm.